Mayer. This is a guy you'd hardly recognize. We've never seen him before. <laughs> Billy Mays is here. Thank you so much for coming. It's a pleasure. By. Thanks you, for having me. You've made quite a mess once again. Well, that, I call me Messy Marvin. Okay. But the nice thing is you clean up your mess. I clean up my mess. It's the last broom you'll ever buy. In fact, it's made out of rubber. Feel light it is. And Cast so aluminum. Lightweight. It has a lifetime guarantee. Now, you don't get a guarantee with a broom like this. balance this properly. I mean, really, you you're unbelievable. Light, you the man. Light, <laughs> lightweight on one finger. So if you're tired of products that are hard that exactly. you're pushing around. You have trouble with your hands or your wrists. And this is aluminum. This is going to yeah. last. Like cast aluminum, lightweight. In fact, I'm standing on the broom. In fact, you can't hurt it. It's made out of rubber. In fact, it has 350 rubber fingers that mm -hmm. form a solid rubber wall. See, when you use brooms like this, they flare apart. You have to do double work, especially on hardwood. Watch this. If we can get a close-up here. Now, without any effort at all, mm -hmm. Are we ready? I'm ready. Watch this, yeah. One pass gets it all. You see how it lines that. everything up? See, there's no going back and forth. Look at this. On hardwood, on any floor, it doesn't matter. Look at this. It cuts it, your work in half. In half, literally. Now, if you know someone that's very difficult to shop for, we're going to demonstrate every surface imaginable you can every use this surface. on. Every surface. Every surface. 920953 is the item number. It's fifteen seventy-five, which is extremely affordably priced, and it's guaranteed for the right. rest of your life. Exactly. The last a great room gift, you'll a ever stocking buy. stuff, a big stocking. Okay. Mm -hmm. In fact, <laughs> let's get right to it. In Why fact, not? the last airing before Christmas, mm -hmm. you buy the first one, fifteen seventy-five. So easy. You spend nearly ten dollars for one of these. Mm -hmm. They get dirty, you toss them out. You get this dirty, I'm going to show you how you can clean it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you can clean with it. Now. Throw all these away because you don't need them. In don't fact, need it at all. These are the biggest uh, collectors of dirt, dust, and pollen. This was in a famous and movie. Bacteria. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I tell you what, if you get the offer here, a lot of people buy more than one. In fact, if you buy the first one, $15.75, we'll offer you the second one at half price. That's our normal deal. Uh -huh. so last that would be, me, that'd be $23, $24. And it's worth it. Mm -hmm. It's the last sure. room. You give one as a gift, one for indoors. A, I'm going to take it a step gift. further. On for, your for airing, us, the last airing for before, sunrise, for the 13, sunrise surprise. Thir Thirteen days hey, to go until free was the place to be. Sunrise <laughs> is a surprise. Yeah, we're gonna give you the second broom absolutely free right now. No additional While they cost. Last, you get the first a one. A bonus broom. A bonus broom. Wow. Absolutely. Now on carpeting, it works on carpeting. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get to that. But we'll here, get to every service, hair folks. You gotta pick thing. up the phone. Use yeah. touchstone ordering. Yeah, I'll tell you. Here's the time. You, you have dog kids, hair, potato chips, leaves. I'll tell you what. Now. If you have little youngsters, they're always eating something where they shouldn't be in front of the television. Here, my little bro our kid, I tell you, that's all he does. Here, now I'm going to rub this in here. Nine out of ten hair salons use a rubber broom. They've mm -hmm. been using these commercially for mm -hmm. the last 22 years. And you'll never now, have to buy another, another one. one. Yeah, wow. lifetime guarantee. And I tell you what, you get two of them. Now, when you use it on any other surface, Paul, linoleum, mm -hmm. underneath cabinets, tight places, look right. at this. Between the toilet and the tub, look at this. It's such a pleasure to do this. If it got any easier than this, you'd have to sit back and watch it. You know, tell you, what. you know what's amazing, too? How many times what you just did, which was so simple and so easy, pulling this right across. You won't scratch your appliances. And you get everything. But how many times have you spilled something like sugar or flour on the, the kitchen fine, floor? Fine, particles. You know, and we're doing, the, we're cooking cookies right now for the holidays. And then you end up pushing that, that grass on a stick, that you call it. <laughs> and it leaves, every, it leaves a trail of everything behind. This does, in one sweep, if you got that flour, that sugar on there. Exactly. And you boy, can use it outside also. Look how simple that is. But here, is. on a it carpeting. Be easier. On a carpeting. Okay. Because I'll tell you what. Oh, too. yeah. In fact, if you have a vacuum cleaner, you know, mm -hmm. if you have a small job, those traffic areas, in fact, we're not telling you not to use a vacuum cleaner, but by the time you get it out of the closet, mm -hmm. unroll the cord, plug it in. Especially for yeah. a small oh, scale. Oh, yeah. So you want to use short strokes. Mm -hmm. Now, you'll create static electricity. When the rubber hits the fibers of the carpeting, it'll pick oh. up the dog hair, the cat hair. Broken glass, kitty litter, it doesn't matter. But you know what? It'll actually go deep down into the pile of the carpeting and restore the nap. And look at this. Use it as an, um, actually an upholstery brush. Take the head of the broom off, okay? In fact, use it on your clothing. Look at this, here, as a That's lint amazing. brush. It's fantastic, but here. I'm gonna go deep down into the pile of the carpeting. In fact, I'll actually miss the, get those fine hairs that sometimes a vacuum will miss. And look those are that. those ones right there. You see okay? that? Now, it'll work on ceramic towel. If I can just scoop down here now, a little bit. Now, we have bit. almost 300 of you in the ordering process right now taking advantage of this. This is the last visit before Christmas that Billy's going to be here. And now, this you know something? I want to speak to this, and I know that we want to talk about all the surfaces. We're going to get to demonstrating this. But let's face it. We have 13 days before Christmas, and last minute, everybody goes out, and you pick some ridiculous, ridiculous. gift. We've all done this. <laughs> you give it to somebody, and you almost know the minute you give it to them, oh, they're returning this. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Give them something they're going to use. You may think it's silly, 
Wow. But they're going to use this. You we keep a, one. It's eight. It's less than eight bucks eight, a piece. Less, I mean, it, it's a steal. Let me How tell about you this. These surfaces yeah. here. Uneven surfaces. In fact, it's flexible. Not only the fingers are an inch long, mm -hmm. they're flexible, so they'll conform to any surface, even outside. Look at this. This is ceramic the most, towel. It's the most See, frustrating thing to clean. See, have you ever played tic tac toe with one of these, <laughs> huh? In between the grout. Right. Yeah. And you always lose because you never get everything. Look how it gets everything up. But here, take it outside. The guys are always stealing the brooms from out inside. Right. Taking them and outside in them. the garage. And, okay, and then they bring them back into the house. Right. Let me ask you this, Paul. How can you clean your house with something that's already dirty? You can't. Well, especially you, you get things outside yeah. with oil exactly. and grease in and fact, dirt. Exactly. What you do, in fact, you can scrub grease and oil off a garage floor, squeegee it down the drain. I'm going to get to that squeegee in a second here. Mm -hmm. But on cement patios, brick look walkways. Look brick with all Oh, yeah. And I'll tell you wow. what. All the uneven surfaces, look at this. It does a terrific job on everything. Now, now back to this. I want to show you real quick over okay. here. Now, you could get it wet. You take the head of in the fact, broom that's off. that's how you clean it. Yeah. You could put it in a dishwasher. So it's sanitary. Oh, yeah. Very, it's very hygienic. Hospitals use these mm -hmm. brooms, in fact. You know, put it in the top rack of the dishwasher, run it under the tap, hot soapy water. Mm -hmm. And it's My clean. dishwasher, Jamie, she loves it. I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> She's out of town. But She's here. putting a lump of coal in your stocking. That's all You know I'm what saying. I want to tell you? You could get it wet and clean with it. Uh -huh. Now, a lot of people scrub their floors, and especially for Christmas. Mm -hmm. You're going to clean every nook and cranny. Right. And a lot of people get down on their hands and knees with a scrub brush. Here's what I'd like everybody to do. In fact, what you want to do is this. Take a glass of water, fill it up all the way. Put your soap or solution okay. in there. Right inside in fact, or your bleach. Drop it on the floor. In fact, that's not uncommon in your house. Right, sure. You know, if you have little, little uh, the little troll, a tri uh, tykes at home. In fact, my grandmother used a SpongeBob. She uh -huh. still was down on her hands and knees. But watch this. Use the 350 fingers to scrub up the rust marks. Look or maybe if that. you move the refrigerator, or the stove, oh, and you see all you those have the rust marks. This, or maybe that cowboy with the scuff marks mm -hmm. coming over for the holidays. Look at this. It'll scrub deep down in. See SpongeBob's and other bobs. They skim over the surface. But here, a lot of people say, "What do you do with the water?" Mm -hmm. Well, it's only a glass of water. If you could see this squeeze. Blade. In fact, it's a razor's edge on there. Right. In fact, now, I'm going to show you real quick and we'll get right down here. Uh -huh. Okay? Watch this. Ladies and gentlemen, what I do in the bathroom and the kitchen, you can scrub ceramic towel with it. You squeegee everything into one corner of the room. And Paul, if you'll be my guest this time and feel that. It's well, you know dry. something? It's dry. It, it <laughs> see, is the most amazing you thing. Actually, <laughs> you you could actually whisk it into a dustpan. I don't know if you can see my fingers, but there's no... Is yeah, it? you know what? If you use one of these sponge mobs, you'll oh, still be right. down on your and hands and that, knees. You'll still be using your fingernail to get that piece walk, of food off. This happens with us. If the kids walk something after you sponge a floor, it's so slippery that they could fall. That's right. This keeps it dry. Hey, I'll tell you something else. How many of you heard this? I don't do windows. <laughs> now don't you do can win do windows. You know, Look with at the this. long reach of the handle, you can squeegee, squeegee the windows. Squeegee, wash and Boy, scrub so them. The screens as well. Aluminum siding, vinyl siding. If you have an RV, a camper, a trailer, it's the best. In fact, on a boat, not skin surfaces. Some of the second story windows and stuff like oh, that. Yeah. So you don't have no. to get real high up no, on ladders it's, to it's do everything. No, it's perfect. And when you can do, wow. you want to do your windows on the inside mm. and the outside. You can Mirrors clean them as well. first. Oh yeah, and then clean. squeegee them. Absolutely. So take a quick call. Oh, absolutely. Hi, you're live with Billy and Paul. Your first name? Hi, Phyllis from Baltimore. Hello, Hi. Phyllis. Hi. You, you know something, Phyllis? I want to ask you something. We have almost 500 people ordering this right now. 476 to be exact. And we have people on hold. But you got through with no waiting. How did you do that? Oh, I use 2D all the time. That's the way to go. That touch tone ordering is the only way to go. Oh, yeah. Is this your first time to try the Dutch rubber broom? Yes, it is. I'm going to give one to myself, one for myself and one for my mother. Isn't that great? She's 82. I think it'll help her a little bit. She got a dog. And you know how dog hair is. Dog hair is so hard to get up, sometimes even with the vacuum cleaner. And you know what's great about this for your mom? What? It's so lightweight. Yeah. It's really know. easy to use, and it'll last a lifetime. Oh, I hope so. <laughs> well, it's guaranteed. If, you know, yeah. if you break it, you send it, you damage it, it'll be it, you replaced. Re we'll replace it free of charge. Isn't well, that great? Good, I, as long as it, it's going to last just like Tectabond does, right? Exactly. Forever. <laughs> Forever. Exactly. I've, I've, been, I've been shopping with Paul, I remember when you were new, brand new. Uh -huh. And it's been a lot of years, and I really always did like you, and your voice was so nice and soothing. And well, thank you. Can you believe it's been almost eight years? Uh, it's hard to believe, but I was shopping like for 10 years with him. Yeah. And I remember when you were brand new. My, uh, my son, when I showed the baby pictures, he's, he's like almost six and a half now. So that time does fly, doesn't it? It does. And I mean, I, I, every, everything you, you sell has been so wonderful. Well, thank you. And he's he's like, the man, I'll tell you. <laughs> I used to, my, my late husband and I used to get up 4 o'clock in the morning to go